Android users and smart watches. The choice is clear. Samsung's Galaxy Watch series has always been the de facto class leader. The Samsung Galaxy Watch 6 series, Samsung's latest and greatest, is no exception. It's got great specs, great build quality, and a return to some beloved features. But in a world of affordable smart watches, does it still make sense to splurge on Samsung's premium wearable? Well, we are about to find out. Now, this year's Galaxy Watch lineup comes in two variants, but the difference aren't as dramatic as you might think. There is the Samsung Galaxy Watch 6 and the Samsung Galaxy Watch 6 Classic. And the biggest difference? Well, you guessed it, it's this rotating bezel. Samsung's rotating bezel has been a fan favorite feature that lets you navigate the interface by, you guessed it, scrolling the bezel. Elsewhere, as always, there are differences in size and battery life. But we'll come to that in a second. First up, let's take a closer look at the Galaxy Watch 6. Now, if you got yourself the Galaxy Watch 5 last year, you are in for a surprise. Hardly anything has changed here. The Galaxy Watch 6 retains the same 40 and 44mm sizing options. The bezels are 30% slimmer this time around, which gives the watch a slim look but it's something you'd only really notice if you kept the two models side by side. Making use of the slimmer bezels, Samsung has upsized the display. Speaking of which, with the peak brightness of 2000 nits, you'll easily be able to view your workouts even under direct sunlight. And yes, the watch is still made of aluminium. Yes, it does have scratch-resistant sapphire crystal glass on the front, and it's the same array of buttons on the sides. Now, the Samsung Galaxy Watch Class A gets a more dramatic upgrading by bringing back the much-loved rotating bezel. And just like the Watch 6, the Watch Classic bezels too has had a 15% reduction in size, which looks even more impressive in person. The watch is available in two sizes, including a 47mm, which is Samsung's largest watch ever. One of the biggest upgrades this time around is in battery size. While the smaller models get an upgraded 300mAh battery, the larger models go all the way to 425mAh, which is amongst the best in the market. That reflects in battery life figures where the Samsung Galaxy Watch 6 will easily be able to last a day and a half. Now, predictably, the plus-sized Galaxy Watch 6 Classic improves on that figure with multi-day battery life that takes away all the range anxiety. But it's not just the bigger batteries to thank you. What's also improved slightly is the processor. The Exynos W930 is clocked just a bit higher than last year's model, which means you can expect a smoother experience. It's also more frugal in battery consumption. The other major upgrades lie in the software. The Samsung Galaxy Watch 6 debuts Wear OS 4 with One UI 5 on top, which is lighter on the battery consumption and gives the two models extended run times. The software is also responsible for extracting more data from the sensors. While not much has changed in terms of sensors, you've still got the 3-in-1 biosensor for heart rate, body composition and EKG analysis. This year, Samsung's Health app can make use of the temperature data as well for period tracking. Sleep tracking has also improved. Catching up with the Apple Watch, Samsung is also debuting a new track run feature which guarantees more accuracy on a running track. Now, is that enough to recommend these two watches? Well, that's where it gets complicated. If you are new to smartwatches and want the most capable Android compatible smartwatch, well, you can't go wrong with the Galaxy Watch 6 and Watch 6 Classic. Running an older watch, well, the Galaxy Watch 3 and even 4 users will find a lot to like here, especially the expanded fluidity and app support for those switching from Samsung's old Tyson based wearables. But if you picked up the Galaxy Watch 5, then prepare for disappointment because the changes are iterative. Maybe skip this generation and wait for the next. Thank you.